Fiona Curran, born, born on March 17th, yeah, so like St. Patrick's Day. Can you imagine somebody born on St. Patrick's Day stealing from the people of Ireland? Yeah, so Cleona Curran lives in uh, Kelowna. Brightish. Yeah, she bought herself like a nice house, like a whole lot of property, like a bitch face full of property, like there, no nothing. And the rest of the money is with the Orange Bank. Can you believe the Orange Bank is actually all built on the money laundering? Yeah, this is all like the, the, the money launderers. Money launderers. Yeah, money launderers of the tears and sweat and bitterness blood buddy yeah so it's time for us to get this money back and cut these motherfuckers to the size so we're going to have like a petition we're going to have like an online petition and recruit the help of the minister of justice of ireland and the, the Attorney General. Do they have like an Attorney General in Ireland or is it like no man? We just have the Shin Finn. We we take people and we shin the fins. Or do we fin the shins and the shins and the fins? <clears throat> so all this money needs to go back. The only redemption from them people, yeah? Them people, who's them people? Oh yeah, and this one is the real, is the Heine. You know, you heard about the Heine of the Jackal. This is the Heine of Hiram. H-Y-E-N-A of I-R-E-L-A-N-D. Yeah, this one is like she has She's, she's the one who's the main ass stuffer. When she, is there like a Motorola? Is there like a Motorola in uh, Ireland? Yeah, she still learned how to steal from Motorola in Ireland by stuffing components up a cant and her ass and a rectum. Like imagine going looking for a Motorola aerial up someone's asshole. Now how despicable would that be? And would would be like a refurbished pad? Again, she lives in Sania, Ontario, Canada, and like each one of them has gone and uh, expanded the business, yeah, the business into, now she's into child trafficking, Yeah, faking, faking. Also, she does like a bingo, bingo like daddy used to do, like fucking the people around. Oh, let's have like a bingo thing so we can cheat all the people of their money. Hmm? And, uh, uh, and also killing old people, killing old people. Right, so with the Heine of uh, Ireland. Them has have the money too. So this money that Miss uh, Maureen has. Maureen's supposed to be dead, but I doubt it. She's never going to die, man. Unless, because um, she don't have no conscience. Oh, she get all the news from the Hello Magazine. This is, a, so she's like the uh, uh, folk, whim folk. 
The Howl magazine is a source of new. Yeah, like the Men in Black. Don't they get the music? All the things from the Hollow uh, magazine. Yep, they do. So the money, if you want, we want to get the money back anyhow, okay? And give it back to where it belongs to the Irish people. If that money was not stolen from the Irish people and it was dedicated to the health system and really put into the health system of the wonderful beautiful country of Ireland you know all that bird poop she that's our bird poop man can you imagine little little droppings of bird poop becoming into the cliffs of Dover and people living and existing on a whole lot of bird shit and proud of it yeah also, these people, they need to be banned from Ireland. Each now, this is perfectly, they, they, you can't, and the fifth one is the don't know who. The Donio family. Now, they have the legal uh, system. You can't pull off all this shit unless you have uh, like a good legal pull. And so the Donio family has exceedingly wonderful and peripheralic. They're like the Lane Spurs. Do you know what the Lane Spurs is? Or they're like uh, the green grass of the around. It's them folk. It's stolen, man. It's stolen all the money. So the, 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 this, this Mr. Donny, again, he's faking, faking this thing. He has helped Maureen Gulagachara to steal the money legally. So you can't really hold these people accountable in Canada because Canada is like a fucked country. Where even Brian Mulroney, you know that that guy, Bree Breen, he just stole the money. Brian Mulroney, now if he could do the A, he can put up a number on the A, the A bus. You remember the A bus scandal? How he like humped the people over? Then he sure as hell as be has his finger in the money. of uh, money laundering of uh, the Irish Irish sweepstakes so now the thing is all the bastards they have Irish passports all of them Karen Gallagher has an Irish passport Cleona Cowran has an Irish passport Shameless, Patrick Ash, ass stuffing, drug mule, son bitch, Curran has an Irish passport, and his daddy, Mike Curran, has an Irish passport, and I'm pretty sure like Donna Yu has an Irish passport, so them all is Irish citizens. So they can be brought to Ireland and held in full account by the Irish legal system. They can be extradited legally to be held accountable for stealing and thieving and money laundering all them fine monies that was raised with love and care for the beautiful Irish emerald, for the emerald that was bird or bird shit. So John, my people, and and bringing them folk to justice. Yeah. So there you go. We have the enemy of the Irish people. 
Hmm? The enemy of that too. So they'll, they'll go over again to repeat ourselves like a fat Irish person is the enemies of the Ireland are Maori Elizabeth Gulligan Shameless ass stuffing, drug meal stuffing. This is caught sir, several times. Can you imagine being caught by the penitentiary with his ass stuff full of drugs? I think that should be like a good picture that we can put up on our mission. The ass stuffer who lives in Point Edward, Ontario. And then Cloud current, she was like a July delinquent. Why would I want to be live a honest life when Daddy and Grandpa were like son my bitches who have been stealing from our very own Irish people? Why would I rock the narrow and thing? So, Cleona Curran, you can find her. She's bought a whole lot of property in in Kelowna, in Yukon, where Maureen Gallagher's hiding with Santa Claus and the Rangers. Yeah. And all that money is with the Orange Bank, invested with the Orange Banky. You can imagine the Orange Banky. And I think, I'm not quite sure about that, but I think current capital, current thing is floated by Mr. Shameless, Pariatric Ashtafa Koran. And then Karen Gallagher is the Heine. She's the Heineman. The Heine of Ireland, Senior Ontario. And of course, the Donahue family is the hair of people. Is the hair. Can we get a picture of Mr. Donahue, sir? Yeah, you gotta make it like very informative. Yeah, so you can't like. So he has helped and facilitated the thieverings of the legitimization of Yeah, now he's retired like he has fucked the whole world over. He has caused the uh, he has killed thousands of hundreds and thousands of distinguished career yeah there you go see you there this there's mr butter boy can we get a close-up mr butter boy sir sure. mr butter boy butter boy butter boy butter boy yeah can we show me your pretty face there you go so he has helped you know, he has helped Gordon Session. So.